Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. It's not my birthday. No, but it's Jackery's birthday. It's the birthday. And these little things, whether it be the Explorer 240, the 500, the 1000, or the brand new 1500s, are brilliant. Um, we just love them, don't we? We do. Jackery were our very, very first channel sponsors, and they've stuck with us um, since we were just babies. Little babies. <laughs> Diddy size. Yeah, we have that. Um, how often would do we use it? All the time we're doing the van builds. Yeah, when we on the Ford. Yeah, it's just got they're just the perfect addition to a van. You know what I mean? And there's what can't you what what have we used it for? Charging phones, keeping laptops going, tablets going, hair straighteners. That'd be me, not Neil. We had the Jackery 240 and it was, it's, this is a great little device. The battery just seems to last forever. But. The big boy. The big boy. They sent us the 1000. Um, we were the friend of ours, Will from Will's Whereabouts. He's got the 1000. Um, we've seen him use it loads because he's got no batteries in his van. He's got no electricity in his van. Everything that he uses in his van plugs into this, doesn't it? Even as Max Air fan. Even yeah. as Max Air fan yeah, plugs yeah, into this. And it's brilliant. Um, another thing I will say about Jackery is there is loads of other batteries out there. There is. There's all sorts of different brands. But there's one problem. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm, what's the problem, then? The battery life. Yes. Wasn't sustainable, was it? No. Right, now, I'm going to prove something to you now. Whether you believe me or not, I don't really care. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to believe it, do so because it's true. This is an actual fact. Jackeries just keep the power. So if you're not using them, then you know when you come to use it, it's full of power, which is good. So we're going to test it now, aren't we? Yes, we are. Mm. Press the display button, babe. Fiddle with me knobs. No. That wasn't the display no, button. No. See, see, that, see that, that one there. That oh, just, yeah. just to, I don't want to point the obvious out to you. But it's, it says display. Um, I mean, I'm <laughs> dyslexic, but I know that tells that the dice play. Dice play. Dice play. <laughs> Press the dice play button. I wasn't looking. I was just pressing something. You just go for any knob you can find, aren't you? It's not a knob. It's a button. Mm, whatever. That's what you call it. I've got a you? knob sat right next to me. But hey, there you go. Press the damn button. Okay. I can't even see it. What does it take? 98%. 98%. This battery has been, it's lost 2%. It, it's held its power. Now that, to me, is a winner. It's a winner, winner, chicken dinner. The small one, the small one does the same. It does. <laughs> we are serious, you know, but we just, it's, she can't <laughs> stop laughing. I don't laugh. We do know somebody who does have a Jackery 1000 and they left their lights on in their van one time. Yeah. What did you do then? Eh? Overnight? They used their Jackery 1000 mm. to recharge the battery. They did. They plugged a battery charger into the 240, onto the 12 volt of the battery and they charged their van battery overnight. And we love them, don't we? We do. I mean, this one's a little bit heavy for me to manoeuvre around. I will say that. That's the only con of it for me but i have a nail well and you you were gonna shine a light in my face yeah, i do like this one because it's got a light on the side so the differences between the little one and the big one right so the little one you've only got 200 watts of pure sound wave inverter inserted hmm. whereas on the big one the big boy with 1000 has got a thousand watts of pure sine wave which basically means that you can run appliances up to a thousand watts this one has got two plugs it's got a thousand watt pure sine wave charger it's got usb-c which is really good for macbooks which is something that the 240 does not have it's got a normal usb and it's also got a quick charge and it's got 
the obligatory cigarette lighter as well. The small one has got, what's it got, Em? On the small one, we've got one plug, two USBs, and then an input for charging, and then we have also the cigarette lighter charging point. The really good. The only difference is this one's got a little bit more, it's a little bit more updated. It's a little bit more expensive. It's got a light on it. Um, there is four models. There's the 240, the 500, the 1000, and the 1500s. Do they replace battery systems in a van? No. No. Do you need an inverter and separate plugs in your van if you've got a jackery? There's a question. It depends on what you want to use it for. Yeah. If, you, if you're using strong and powerful appliances like my hairdryer yeah then yes but the new one the 1500 was actually run your hairdryer yes it was mandy will run microwaves and people have run dishwashers of them and all sorts of things but me personally if i was building a van now and we had a jackery 1000 i wouldn't bother putting 240 in and I genuinely wouldn't, I wouldn't bother with an inverter, I wouldn't bother with the cables, I wouldn't bother with the sockets. Uh, you may just have one socket for when you were on hook up outside, but I wouldn't bother putting a 240 system onto a 12 volt system to have power. I would purely just run off the jackery. We've had them outside, you know, we've you've used them outside, we've been, you know, I'm not saying we've put this in a bag and... It's a bit this one's all right. That one's all right. But they are portable, you can carry them around, you can throw them in the car. This small one, where have you just got this from? This small one? Oh, from our little meep. It was just been a little car because I've been out and done jobs for people and I use this to run the solder and iron off because it's perfect. And this hasn't been charged in forever. And it genuinely hasn't, it's on 77% and this has been out with me plenty of times and it just seems to hold the battery. So, fun facts about the jackery. Are they waterproof? No, babe. No, you so you can't have them in the wet? No. Okay. Um, where does the name jackery come from? It is a combination of... Jacket and battery. Yes, that was it. Mm. Because... The team who developed jackery used to work for Apple. Not all of them. Some of them. One of them. What did they used to make for Apple? Used to make the jackets on the batteries. There's not much more we can say about Jackery apart from thank you very much for helping us with the channel and thank you for sponsoring us. Also, if you want the links, where are they? Down here. <laughs> where? Well, I don't see them. Oh, in the description. Silly no. me. In all serious, if we didn't but that sent them, um, would we have bought one down the line? We probably would have. Because you see people using them all the time and then having the solar panels, you know, the jackery solar panels that you can just plug into them which you keep in the back of the van. They are brilliant. They are. And it charges up in no time, doesn't it? Yeah, we were, we were way shocked at how quickly yeah, they do charge. Like super, super fast. Plus as well, you can plug into the cigarette lighter Plug into your car, van, plug into your jackery, and when you're driving, charge it up. Free power. They also do reckon that you decharge them and recharge them every three months as well. Yes. If you've got one and you're not using it, just prolongs your battery life. Yes, it does. Because they're lithium ion batteries and they got the smarts. Just like Emma. Bye bye. You may not see him again. <sighs> it's all light on it, though. Now don't put your hand on my face.